guys, it's Jesse James Decker here. So I'm really, really, really excited to show you guys something that is going to be for you. I've teamed up with Fave 4. Um, they're my favorite hairspray company ever. And um, we decided to come up with a kit to get my sex kittenish look. So when you order it, it'll look like this. Look at my lips. My new A4. This is amazing. And it's gonna give you kind of my signature big hair look. And I'm gonna show you what comes inside of it. So you're gonna open it up. There's me, right there. And it's just gonna give you an idea and kind of a, um, I guess all the ingredients to get that good, good old sex kitten hair. So when you open it up, you're going to get <clears throat> texture takeover. I'm obsessed with this because it makes your hair really huge and big. So I spray a lot of this. And then after you use that, you're going to go over it with a light weight gloss hairspray to kind of keep it in place. But you don't want it to be so hard and crunchy that you can't like re redo it or whatever. You're also going to get, it's going to have all this pretty little stuff in here. Crap, here we go. Bring it up. Teaser comb. This is my favorite teaser comb ever. It's the best one to get your hair big. And da 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 da! You're gonna get a bandana! This is like a one of a kind bandana. And I'm gonna show you how to put it in and how to get that look. So let's start from the beginning. So. I'm gonna start off by curling my hair a little bit. This doesn't come in there, but you can get this from Walgreens. This is Conair. Um, my hair is already kind of done, so I'm just gonna curl it a little bit, just to give you the idea. Just some pieces. Um, and again, you can get this from anywhere. You can get this from, this is Conair. This is like the one and a half inch barrel, I think. We're gonna be kind of beachy today, not too not too curly, not too crazy. And yes, I'm sitting on my floor, but I always like to sit on the floor when I do my hair. I don't know why, like you get this gorgeous vanity that comes to the house and I always end up putting a mirror on the floor and just putting a towel down. I know y'all do that too. Okay. See, it's just kind of beachy. It doesn't need to be like ridiculous. I'm not gonna make it too curl because we're going to do that with the product and with the teaser comb. And if you, if y'all at home don't know how to do this, I do have a tutorial on how to curl hair, but I always take it behind, wrap it around and at the very end. And I don't ever curl the very bottom piece and I'm doing like the beachy thing. See, just kind of meow. Clearly I didn't brush out all of my teased hair from yesterday. Okay. Just curl it all up. And again, I'm not doing every piece. I'm doing like four or five strands of hair on both sides of my hair. Cause you just don't want it to be too much. Sure you can hear Vivian fussing downstairs with Sydney. Okay, so that's kind of waved out. And again, you don't need it to look too, too crazy. So I'm gonna go over this with the light weight um, glossing hairspray just so it stays. I'm just gonna kind of fool with it, mess it up a little bit. Now my hair was already kind of um, waved out from yesterday when I did it. I just didn't wash it or anything. So you might have to go a little, um, might have to spend a little bit more time on curling it. But I'm gonna go back a little bit here. I use a lot of this. And I'm gonna tell you all, this stuff smells phenomenal. I hate when you get hairspray and it smells like crap. And it's just, you just, then you smell bad. You may look good, but you're gonna smell bad. And you can lose friends that way. So. My hair is now sprayed, I'm gonna stay in place. Now we're gonna go in with the teaser comb 
and we're going to tease it up. So go in different layers of your hair. Y'all know how to tease. Just go crazy with it. Obviously this is damaging, so when you're done, put a little coconut oil after you wash your hair. And I'm gonna use a texture takeover, and I'm gonna directly spray it on there. And then just mess it up right there. Flip it back over. Ooh, yeah! Okay, other side now. Y'all can see my weave over here. Don't judge me. Don't judge me! When you have a baby, all your hair falls out, so you got a little, need a little help. All right, tease, tease, tease. Spray over it. And bam, baby! And that's just the top layer. So let's go underneath. And if you want, I mean, at home, you can always, like, use a clip or whatever to hold it back. Okay, you're going to get in here. Tease, 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 tease. All right. Big ol' hair. I'm gonna go on this side as well. Tease, tease, tease. Spray. So I feel like what I'm showing you is so easy. Now we're gonna go to the back. Just get you a little piece. Comb. Same thing. Hairspray. Texture. And look at that. Look how big this made my hair. It is just, woo! It looks like bedhead hair. So we're gonna go over it again with this stuff. The lightweight gloss just so it all stays in place. Cause if you're anything like me, my hair goes flat like that and it's a sad state of affairs when that goes down. I literally keep a teaser comb in my purse. Okay, so the hair is looking big. Now, my favorite part, the bandana. I'm really excited about this bandana because I've never seen one like this before and I wanted it to be unique so we could, you know, be in individuals with our gorgeous, unique bandana. So fold it in half, which you know how to do, and we're going to roll it up. I can't really show you that. You, you get the point. You're going to roll it all the way until it's all the way tucked in. Okay, all rolled in. And you're going to put it in your head, the part that's folded, okay, and I'm going to my hair back like this, wrap it around the head, and we're going to tie it just like that, and boom, you got your big old hair with the, with the bunny ears. So sometimes I don't like the bunny ears and sometimes I do. Um, today I might fold them in and, and sometimes you can see that I do that when I post pictures. I will fold them in just to give it a little bit more of a discreet look like that. Cute, right? Or sometimes I'll just leave them out and let them do its thing. So once the bandana is in, you can go over it again with the hairspray, just so all this stays in. I have all these baby hairs growing back since my hair fell out when I got pregnant. And spritz it all so it all stays and is fabulous. And voila, you've got kittenish hair. So you can see this was super easy, easy process. I mean, I'm looking at the time now and it's nine minutes and 33 seconds, so clearly, this really didn't take very long. Super easy. Um, and all I needed was these two guys right here. And they smell so good, so easy to use. And one of my favorite things about them is you can close it like that. So you can travel with them and it won't, you know, get all over your stuff. And teaser comb. So two hairsprays. 
teaser comb, and a bandana, and you can get this look. So easy and so fun. Um, I hope it worked for you guys at home trying this out. Um, you'll get this whole little package. This could be good for the holidays. You can get it for someone for Christmas or just get it for yourself. I do that quite a bit, get myself gifts. I'm too impatient to tell people what I want. Um, but great for the holidays coming up and get it from your friend, your sister, your mom. And I'll give you the steps right here just in case you want to read it. I'm, I'm one of those that needs to visually see it like in a video, but some people like to read the directions. You can read the directions here to get the kittenish look. And, uh, and that's that. Voila. All right, I love you guys. Hopefully this was helpful, and I'll see you again soon. Bye.